Oh my god. So me and Anthony went to um, Aldi today and we got this Nerf dog gun. Oh my god. I'm so excited. This is a cannon um, blaster. Launches up to 50 feet. It comes with three balls already. So we're going to take these out. Oh my god. I'm so excited. This is the gun. Oh, I have one more I didn't clip. Hold on. Let me clip that. All right. So... Put the balls in there. Do you can I put multiple? Let me see if I can put multiple. All right, so you can only load one at a time. So let's put this one down in there. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Let's go shoot this thing. Mumu, I got a surprise for you. Let me put these other balls down. Hold on. Oh my gosh. Mumu. Yeah, she caught it. You should call the ball. Yeah, you do. She's my ball player. She loves the ball. That one would rather chase things. She loves it. <laughs> this gun is fun. Very cool. Worth the 10 bucks for sure. What do you want to eat? You don't want short ribs, do you? I'm not hungry. Of course not. You're never hungry, woman. <clears throat> So then I got this pet cooling toy. You put them in the freezer and then um, it's a cold thing for them to chew on in hot days. And this one you can put peanut butter in or treats. And then I just got this one too, which is the pet cooling toy. And you just put these in the, pop them in the freezer. And this one's just like a round cylinder tire. And then they are cold for hot days, and then it's just something for your dog to chew on. So I got those too. And then also at Aldi, I got these giant dominoes. 28 jumbo cards, great for the backyard, the beach, camping, picnics. Um, and I figured this would be super fun for Anthony and I um, to play outside. So I figured that's so fun. I wonder what they look like. Let's open them up. Alright, so it comes with instructions. And then these are the dominoes. Pretty big. I'd say like 10 inches or so. But pretty cool. So our plants are really taking off. Look at how pretty. Oh, it's so pretty. And then we have one over here that is a complete different color. Let me get that weird. Is, um, look at it. But if you know that somebody's been gnawing on it, probably one of these <laughs> chicken nuggets. Momo! Yeah, that one probably. That's it, I'm getting the noodle. You want the noodle? So in the evenings, Anthony and I love to come to this spot in our yard that has our hammocks. And he cocoons up like a cocoon. Yeah. <laughs> in a cocoon. Oh. In his. And he just likes to relax. Mm -hmm. And then I lay in mine like so. And I watch my birds at my bird feeder, my squirrel feeders, and we just hang out here and listen to the birds. And then we watch the dogs. I don't know where the dogs I went to, each other. but we watch the dogs play. And we just sit out here and we talk about life and plans and. All the things, huh, babe? Yep. Yes, we do. And it's 88 degrees out right now. It's 8 o'clock at night. Yep. <laughs> I love it. Absolutely love summer. 
this is what we just do as a married couple. We just hang out in our hammocks and talk and dream and buying a campsite. Thinking about buying a campsite? I'd like to buy one, put a cabin on it. Yeah. I really would. That'd be awesome. Nothing big, not like a big cabin, just like a shack. Yeah. You know, running water, plumbing. Is that a helicopter? That thing's low. I don't see it. It's over here to the right somewhere. Where's it? Probably life light, huh? Oh, I hear it. Somewhere. Probably life light. I think it's life light, yeah. Where is it? Oh, oh there it is. is. There it is. Uh, That's going. definitely life light. light. Oh, what is that on my tree? They fly over here all day. Some type of interestingness. Oh. I'm swinging my, I'm swinging, I get stopped. What is that? We need to get pillows right here. Oh, I got to fall asleep. Huh. Pillows, yes, let's get pillows. Momo live! Oh, I see you. Are you still filming? Oh, there they are, yeah. Look at my girls. Look at my girls. Oh, woodpeckers are really pecking this tree to death. Huh? Hello, Mumu. Is your Mumu? This is a Mooly. This is a Mooly. And there's a Livador. A Mooly. All right, goodbye. So you're probably wondering why I'm emotional. <laughs> I just got done to listening to my husband's band. They made a song and it's so good. It's so good and I'm just so proud of him and his band and all the bandmates. I'm so proud of them. They've been working on this song forever and it means a lot to them and it means a lot to my husband it's just I didn't think that it would make me emotional but just listening to like the final cut is like it's so good <laughs> it's so good I can't wait to show it share it with you guys but it's so good and I'm just so proud of him and them and uh, this whole band. I'm just so proud of them for sticking it out and I know sometimes it could be rough or frustrating or whatever, but I'm just so proud of those four that they just have stuck it out and have become close friends and I can't speak for all of them, but I can speak for my husband, and my husband loves to play. He loves to play guitar, and he likes, he loves those guys, like brothers, like really honestly loves them. And I'm sorry, I should have a baby. But I'm just so proud of them, and I'm just excited for my husband because this means a lot to him and because it means a lot to him it means a lot to me <laughs> I'm just excited I'm excited for them and I'm excited to see just how many boundaries and I'm excited to see how many boundaries they push they actually honestly give it their all and push and I'm super excited to see like how far they're gonna go. I'm just very proud and the song is so good. Okay, I'm gonna get off of here and get my shit together. <laughs> but I wanted to document this moment that I'm just so proud.